friends, welcome back to our Spanga Tucson YouTube channel. My name is Marissa and it is a pleasure to work with you today. We are going to do a nice yoga flow together. It's a little bit on the gentler side, but we're going to get a little into that core, stretching through the hips, a little through the shoulders as well. If you've never been in studio with us before here at Spanga Tucson, we do 20 minutes of spin. 20 minutes of strength and 20 minutes of yoga in our hour-long sessions. This allows us to combine the three pillars of fitness, making it truly the best workout ever. So hopefully at some point you can join us in studio. If you are local, please hit me up and I can get you in for a free session to try us out. When you are ready, hop into some comfy clothes, grab that water bottle, and let's get started. Today, my friends, we are starting all the way up at the tippy top of that mat, lifting through the chest, relaxing the hands down. Inhale, nice big reach all the way up towards the ceiling. Exhale, let those palms face down, let it go. Inhale, sweeping all the way up and open. Exhale, palms face down, let it go. Inhale, find that third nice big reach. Plank down through all four corners of the feet. Spread the fingers, reaching up high to the ceiling. Exhale, hinging forward at the waist. Hands come down towards those toes, forward fold. Inhale, hands to shins, flat back, half lift. Exhale, full fold all the way down towards that mat. Find a little bend through those knees. Soften through the shoulders. Let the head relax down. You always have the option here to grab opposite elbows if that feels nice for you today. Maybe a little sway side to side or a nod, yes or no. On your next inhale, hands come to shins, halfway lift, flat back. Exhale, full fold. Inhale, step both feet back, find a nice high plank. You always have the option here to drop those knees down if that feels better for you. Tucking the elbows in, yogi push-up. Inhale, up dog, lifting through the knees, the shins, the hips. Exhale, send the hips up and back, downward facing dog. Beautiful job here, big breath in and out, pressing in with all 10 of those finger pads, maybe walking those feet if that feels good for you today. Bending one knee and then the other nice and slow. One more breath. And then inhale, looking forward between those hands, stepping both feet up, forward fold. Inhale, hands to shins, halfway lift. Exhale, full fold. Inhale, sweep those arms all the way up and open to the sky. And exhale, hands arrive at heart center. Inhale, nice big reach. Exhale, full fold. Inhale, halfway lift. And exhale, full fold. Inhale, step both feet back. Nice high plank. Let's run through our yogi flow. Shifting that weight forward, yogi push up. Inhale, up dog. And exhale, down dog. Inhale, looking forward between those hands. Step both feet up, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, full fold. Inhale, sweep those arms all the way up to the sky. And exhale, hands arrive at heart center. Inhale, nice big reach. Exhale, full fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, full fold. Inhale, step both feet back. Meet in your high plank, holding here for three, two, and one, drop those knees down to the mat. Take the big toes together. The knees out nice and wide. Send those hips back, meeting me in your child's pose. So melting the head, neck, and chest down towards the mat, sinking that upper body in as you send the hips back towards those toes. Creating a little extra space, a little extra love through those shoulder blades with every inhale, breathing in not just to the belly, but into the chest and into that upper back to expand. As you exhale, sinking down a little bit deeper. One more breath, nice big inhale. And exhale, release. 
Inhale, slowly rise and back on up, meeting me in a tabletop position. Walk the knees under those hips, hands directly under the shoulder blades, pressing with all 10 of those finger pads. Inhale, drop the belly, drop the chest, let the head rise. Exhale, navel tucks up and in towards the spine, let the head fall. Inhale, finding that cow pose. Exhale, arching up and back. Inhale, dropping down. Exhale, arching up and back. And then inhale, finding a nice neutral spine. When you're ready, step those right toes out on the mat underneath you, pressing forward and back through the heel, a little toga, if you will, stretching those toes, giving those feet a little extra love. Beautiful. When you're ready, draw that foot up to hip height, toes pointing down. On your exhale, knee comes to nose. Inhale, reach up and back. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, send it out. Exhale, drawing it in. Inhale, out. One more time. Exhale, in. And inhale, out. Pressing in with that heel. Toes are still pointing down. Option to stay right here, engaging the core. Or we lift that left hand out, finding a balance. Squeeze the stomach, reaching in opposite directions. Exhale, coming back to the mat. Finding one more round of cat and cow here. Inhale, dropping down. Exhale, arching up and back. And inhale, finding that nice flat spine. So same thing, other side. Stepping the left toes out, tuck them under. Bounce through that heel for me here. When you're ready, lift the foot up to hip height. Toes pointing down. On your exhale, knee comes to nose. Inhale, reaching out and back. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, send it back. Exhale, tucking in. Inhale, reaching back one more time. Exhale, in. And inhale, back. Holding here, option to bring that right arm out, reaching in opposite direction, squeeze the core. For three, two, and one, dropping it down. Knees stacked back under those hips. Walk the hands a step in front of where they just were. Sinking the head, neck, and chest down. Keep the hips up nice and high for puppy pose. Breathing in and out here. You don't have to bring the chest and the chin all the way to the mat. If that doesn't feel good for you, you can be more here. This is A-OK. -okay. But the goal is to relax the head a little bit between those shoulders, a little bit between those arms, so we get that extra stretch through the shoulder blades. One more nice breath in and out right here. Inhale, slowly working your way on up, walking the hands back under those shoulders, taking a moment here. Inhale, take it into that cow. Exhale, arching up and back for cat. And inhale, finding that nice flat spine. When you're ready, step the right toes out behind you once again. This time, bringing the sole of the foot to the mat. Draw that left foot back at an angle for a little more support. Inhale, reach the right arm all the way up and open to the sky. Nice big reach up with a T through those arms. Pressing into that right hip, reaching it up. On your next exhale, right arm reaches up overhead, gaze tilts down towards the mat, bicep in line with the ear, full side body stretch. Inhale, arm reaches all the way up and open to the sky. Maybe you hover those right toes up. They can be right here, just about an inch off that mat. Or maybe you find that full balance right here, good. If you're feeling feisty today, you can reach back, grab a hold of those toes with the hand, stay right here, or kick in to that hand, finding a half tiger. 
Exhale, that knee comes back down to the mat, returning to our tabletop position. Inhale, stepping the left leg out this time, placing that sole of the foot down, right toes extend back, reach that left arm all the way up and open to the ceiling, opening out like a nice big T, reaching through that side body right here. Big breath in and out right here. As you're ready, reaching that arm up overhead, gaze tilts down towards the hand. Nice big stretch through that side body. As you're ready, arm reaches back up towards the ceiling. Maybe we hover those toes up off the mat. Could be an inch, could be all the way up at that hip, holding strong here. You can stay right here, or you can reach back for those toes, kicking into the hand if that feels good for you. Beautiful, one more breath. And then we exhale, return back down to the mat. Walking the hands out a step in front, send the hips forward, a plank on those knees. Exhale, coming all the way down onto our bellies, hands under those shoulders. Exhale, relax everything down. Inhale, engage those glutes, lifting up through the chest for baby cobra. You should be able to comfortably lift the hands here. Exhale, release. Inhale, rising back on up. This time, as you engage, maybe you lift that right foot up just a little bit here. And exhale, release. Inhale, rising up. Maybe that left leg lifts up just a little here. And exhale, release. One more time. Inhale, engage, rise up. Maybe those feet kick up. Maybe the hands hover. Big breath in and exhale, release. Pressing up onto those hands and knees. We're gonna swing the legs around so we're coming on to our bottoms. Bringing the heels in front of you on the mat, lifting the chest. So starting off with our hands back by our sides, leaning back until you feel that core engage. When you're ready, maybe lift the heels and then maybe lift those hands as well. So lifting up through the chest, reaching tall through that spine for three, two, and one. Taking the soles of the feet together here for me, knees out nice and wide, holding on to the ankles, lift tall through the spine, exhale, forward fold. Maybe a little nod, yes or no, through the back of your neck, if that feels nice for you today. Big breath in, exhale, release. Settle in, settle down. Inhale, slowly rising back on up, taking any comfortable, easy seat that feels good for you, crisscross applesauce, a half lotus, whatever floats your boat today. Hands relax gently on the knees or in the center of the lap. Inhale, chin lifts up to the sky. Exhale, chin to chest. Two more times. Inhale, lifting up. And exhale, nodding down. One more. Inhale. And exhale. Once that chin meets chest, inhale, take a nice big circle through the neck all the way around and back. One more time in this direction. When chin meets chest, go ahead and take it around the other direction, up and back, exhaling down and around. One more time. Meeting me chin at chest, exhale. Inhale, sitting up tall through that spine, walk the right hand over to the left knee, left hand back behind the sacrum. Inhale, lifting through the chest, exhale, twisting into that mid spine, looking over the back shoulder. Breathing in and out here. One more breath. Inhale, coming back through center, taking it to the other side, reaching back, lift tall through the spine. 
Exhale, looking over that back shoulder as you're ready. One more breath right here. Settle in, find that tall spine, and then find an inhale to come back through center right here. As you're ready, we're gonna work our way on to our backs in your own time. So slowly lowering down. When you arrive, hug the knees up and into the chest. Give everything a nice big squeeze. Maybe a little rock side to side. Taking the first two fingers on either hand, loop them around the big toes. Soles of the feet go parallel to the ceiling above you, knees tucked back by the armpits for happy baby. Taking three nice big breaths here, pulling down on the feet while kicking up into the hands. Maybe a gentle rock side to side if that feels nice on your body today. On your next exhale, soles of the feet come to the mat. Arms reach out like a T, gentle windshield wiper side to side. Just a couple times in each direction, relaxing everything down. And then as you're ready, extending those legs out nice and long on the mat. Palms come face up by the sides and close your eyes. Take a nice big exhale, let go of everything you're holding on to today. Inhale deeply, taking the biggest breath in that you've taken so far today. Open your mouth and sigh it out. Inhale even deeper. And sigh it out. Last one, inhale. And sigh it out. Now allow your body to be still as we spend just these next few moments in silent relaxation. Begin to bring attention back to your breath. Take a big breath in and gently out. As you are ready, finding a little wiggle in the fingers and the toes, making any gentle adjustments that feel right for you to reorient to the space around you. In your own time, rolling off to one side or gently rocking your way up to any comfortable, easy seat so we can end our session together. Beautiful work today, everyone. Join me with hands at heart center. Thank you all so very much for tuning in today. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. We always love to end on a positive note. And my positive today is just that we have been able to remain open and safe in our center here. If you are a member, you know how diligent we are about everything that happens in this space, and I am so grateful for each and every one of you. Thank you all for this beautiful session. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, and I'll see you next time.